Arbitration continues to grow and has become incredibly popular over time. With this, a question that is sometimes asked is whether litigation financing costs are recoverable? The United Kingdom High Court has finally given us an answer to this. The court was presented with an appeal brought by SR Oilfield Services after an arbitrator directed them to pay not only damages and attorney's fees, but also the opposing party's costs of their litigation financing. The opposing party, Norscott, used litigation financing to help pay for their €647,000 in attorney's fees, and as a result of their successful arbitration, now owed their financer three times that amount. In this case, the Arbitration Act of 1996 is the governing legislation. This act states that an arbitrator can award costs to the winning party. Additionally, the definition of costs in this legislation is defined as legal or other costs of the parties. The High Court agreed with the arbitrator that other costs was broad enough to include the recovery of litigation financing costs. The High Court and arbitrator were especially motivated to award the financing costs in addition to the other damages because SR Oilfield Services conduct was incredibly egregious. They went on to state that SR Oilfield Services strategy was specifically designed to inhibit Norscott's ability to seek justice. As a financer, this situation comes about all the time. If this decision catches on worldwide, this huge problem of corporation dominance would essentially be eliminated. It is too soon to even guess the future implications of this decision, but it is a sign that the times are changing. In the meantime, it never hurts to ask may apply in situations such as these.